Hey, what's up everybody out there in YouTube land? Eldrick Ferris, Editor-in-Chief, here once again on the Motherboards.org YouTube channel. Okay, so today we're going to bring you guys another unboxing. Know how you folks love them. Today we're doing the Sapphire Radeon HD6870 Flex Edition. Now, what is the Flex Edition? The Flex Edition is where you get all pumped up with your muscles. You know, me, you pumped up with the Flex Edition. No, but really the Flex Edition is the Flex Edition features five monitor iFinity support. That's the big thing about it. Most of the other cards only support three monitors. If you want six monitors, you've got to use two cards. This card's like somewhere like right in between, maybe a three quarters version of full iFinity because you can use five monitors off the Flex Edition. So now let's check out what is inside of the box of the Flex. Okay, so right now, here's the front of the box for all you folks to like take a look at the front of the box and we'll spin it around the back. So you can see the back. Then we'll go ahead and begin to try to open the box. There's little tabs on these little boxes. I'll try to get up on here. These ones open pretty well with your fingernails. They don't even really damage the box. I usually use my big unboxing knife, but for these ones, the box seems to get cut when I do that. So on these, I'm just using my little fingernail and then pulling the little tab off. As you can see, it doesn't even destroy the box. doesn't rip anything at all. And the tab easily opens up after that. You can get the box out. Now, I'm not even going to say it, but you guys know there's a inside the... So here we're going to take a look at this. Go ahead and open this thing up. And no matter which time I open it up, it always opens it up the wrong way. No matter which way I try, I don't know if Sapphire does that just to confuse the heck out of me every time, but it's always seems a little bit different. Once again, I hit the microphone. The cameraman's going to love me for that. He just loves that editing stuff with a big old boom, boom, boom. So here we're going to take a look at the card. Now, this card's pretty crazy looking. The Flex Edition, it's not based on the reference design either. It's totally aftermarket. I'm gonna spin it around here. You guys can see the copper heat fins and the copper heat pipes that are in here, excuse me, correction. The copper heat pipes. And underneath that is a giant heat fin. So all this helps keep the card running cool. There are two six pin power connectors. I'm sure inside the Sapphire box, we're gonna have Molex to connectors for those. They always include it. Here is the crossfire little bridge finger, the bottom of the card where it sticks in. The card takes up two slots. Now, this card is a little bit longer than the normal card. This card is about 9.5 inches long, so it's a little bit bigger than the standard reference 6870s. Might want to keep that in mind in your case. Then we're going to take a look at the rear I.O. We have two mini display ports, HDMI, and two DVI ports. Notice there's a difference in color in these DVI ports. That is for doing the iFinity Edition setup. So we'll move on. Once again, there's another box with all the accessories. Sapphire, I will say, is always known for their accessories. They give an awful lot of stuff in their boxes. They do not cheap you at all. So we're gonna start out with this again. Cameraman, focus in there. Got the Sapphire Select Club. What is the Select Club? The Select Club is where you go online, you register your card, and when they have promotions and specials, you can be qualified to win them by being part of Sapphire Select Club. You also get the driver CD, and inside there is a little tiny little case badge. Can't really see it. I'm sure you guys can get a little thing there, but there's a little case badge inside there as well if you want to use it. Then you get a Sapphire little quick installation guide. Most people who are doing video cards these days, I assume, probably know what they're doing. You get the old school DVI to standard VGA connector. Not many people are probably using that. You get the mini HDMI to the standard HDMI, little cable bracket. Then you get the high speed HDMI cable itself. Quite a bit of stuff here. These things can be up to 10 or 15 bucks depending on where you buy them from, you get ripped off. Two of these Molex to six pin connectors, very useful for those who have old power supplies. And then here is one thing that's different than all the other ones. This is part of hooking up the Flex iFinity setup. This is one of the cables that's for that. You know it's, it's different than the other cables. Go ahead and set that down there. And then last but not least, we get the Crossfire bridge cable right here. So all together, you get the card and all of this stuff inside the new Sapphire Radeon HD6870 Flex Edition card. Thank you for watching. We will all get pumped up together later.